Hello, uh, I decided to show you what I uh, achieved today with the quartz uh, camera. There was a faulty knob, so I, uh, I cleaned it. I, I uh, actually uh, did an article, did a post about it in my blog. But I would like to show you the result. Which is uh, actually I'm recording the sound with my Olympus uh, LS LS10, which is a uh, I think a high-end uh, voice recorder, and I I hope that it will be uh, a better sound on, uh, during my video. So here is the here is the camera. Uh, I recognize that the this button doesn't work in this supposed to this is supposed to uh, make possible to rewind the film when when you finish but uh, it seems that it doesn't work so you're not able to rewind the film at the end of uh, shooting Anyway, let's uh, open it so you can see the uh, progress we made. So yesterday uh, I uh, showed you. This is actually this is an this is a, an original Ferrania roll here that that was left. In the, in the camera, I don't think it came with it. It's made of metal, but I don't think it it it, it came with the camera. Uh, this is the film length measurement system, and this here, this little spring, which you cannot see now, but I will make it possible to see. This little spring here is the one that has. Uh, that prevents the plate from taking off, so you have to move this spring. Now it's in its place, so I will leave it there. And th that was the fault, you know. And yesterday, if you can, you can check out my other video that it didn't work. Now I could open, I could take this cover half off, and then under it I could spray, I could uh, sprinkle a little bit of gun oil, like. This this gun oil. I also <laughs> actually was trying WD-40, but then I gave up on it because I don't have much in it. So anyway, let's just try and let I show you. <clears throat> it's much smoother to to re to wind the thing now, and uh, to say that to win this, you actually have to do it in a certain way, because if you do it like always turning like this, this will actually uh, end up losing losing the whole th stuff so what you do is you turn and then you turn it back then back then forward this is how you pull it up and this way until it's stuck it's sti that's the end now I even do this to prevent it from falling off so uh, now, actually, it's set to 16 frames per second right now, and uh, we'll see. I hope you will see. This was it. Uh, as you could see, n the, the, it didn't stop, not for a second, and because that second was the film jam, actually, it made it made the film jam. But now it turns, and actually it goes for a longer time uh, with the wind up. So I think that it can be done like 30 seconds with a single pull up, with a pull up, 30 seconds and full pull up sorry and uh, i think it will be fairly enough 
I, I will try it and maybe next week sometimes uh, we will have a test shot with it and we'll see okay to this part you always have to look for the the, the side with the arrow on it uh, and every any 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 uh, film roll has it any has has on one side an arrow and that arrow goes down to the downing that the down knob not to the up so to put it up you have to turn it over so this was it thanks for watching and check out my blog